big old brass buckle. Isn't that a song, Buckle Up Your Overcoat? Oh, it's Button Up Your Overcoat. That rang 86, 87. So, you know what I was hoping. Oh, I don't think things are quite that desperate. Well, I kept at it. Look at that mess. And look here. It's fat. It's too small for a nickel. What in the world is it? Suppose it's a foreign coin? Or is it just a plug? I'm going to have to work it over. That's all I can do. I bet it's a foreign coin of some sort. See, that's where the house was stood here and it was burned. And then, of course, you can see this hard clay crap. So... It could be anything that got buried after the fire. Just from the looks of it, look how thick it is. I'd say it's probably a foreign coin of some sort. I don't see anything on it. But it looks like it has a has an edge. Well, let me pause and I'll see. Get something off of it. The best I can tell is just a copper plug. Blank. Nothing. It does happen. However, I'll keep looking. I mean, it doesn't look degraded like it was a coin and it got wiped away. It just looks like a copper blank. Let me see what it rings. It rings like 7880, so it is copper, obviously. We will find out. Maybe it's a buried can of coins. You got it. Part of the cook stove. Sweet. <laughs> you know, they ate. Oh, I gotta take a nap. I don't know if Solid. Solid 56, and it's really loud. Yeah, it's got to be junk. Let me see. Oh my gosh, look, look at that, I can't believe it, look, oh, uh -huh. look, look, oh, uh -huh. look, oh, uh -huh. oh, look, oh, uh -huh. oh, uh -huh. Oh, look at all. Oh, I can't believe it. <laughs> oh, it's everywhere. <gasps> well, I don't I don't think that's a largey. How about that? I don't think it's plastic. No. Glass or porcelain. Very nice. That's my first blue button like that. Four holer. Obviously it's newer, but probably turn of the century. Harder than heck to get out of here. I have a little button. There's a chunk of iron right there. Oh, I kept hearing it. I can't listen to your attempts so, to try and justify yourself. Tell you if you if you think you're something there, you just gotta keep working at it. A lot of times I'll just spread it out and of course you'll have nail here and you'll get a buzz and and for long you'll you'll hear something like that. So Alright. Okay, I got a pretty good tone. Let me see here.
Oh, looky there. It looks like silver. Uh, let me see. I'll just bump it a little bit there. Oh, it's a Merc. Yeah, I, I doubt if it's a 16D. Great. Forty two. Well, it's a very popular version. A little silver makes a smile all day long. Let's see what we got here. This was almost completely lost in the iron. There's a bunch of iron down there, but it came through and it's like an eighty one, eighty two, so I assume it's probably a weedy, but I might be wrong. Yeah, that's it, but it acts like it's another signal. Can you believe that? I think it's just iron over in the other hole now. Whatever it is, I got it out. It's just a nail is all that is. Let me get back to you. What do you think? I just got Spanish silver. This is what they call Detroit Road. And you've heard me talk about this before. But uh, Hall's troops for the War of 1812 marched up this road to Detroit. And then, of course, you know the story about him getting, uh, not getting there in time and facing a hanging and so on. I think that'll shine up. Looks like it's tarnished really heavily. You can see it's bent over. But the numbers are there. But you can see the edges shining. These were 80% silver. Yeah, you see it's cracked down the middle. Well, let me see if I can get cleaned up. I'll get back to you. I hope there's something I can read. Okay, I got a happy day here. It is 1700s, so we can see Carlos. Let me see here. I had it. Carlos the Third is looking. Hold on. There he is. See his nose. Let me. We'll let that focus. He's looking to the uh, right. There's his nose. He has that big honker. So that's Carlos the Third, which means this is uh, 1700s. He reigned up till 1787, I believe it was. Yeah, we'll do a little soaking on it. Maybe we can get a better uh, look at some of it. I think I just found a great big musket ball. 
You get the light on it. And it's too much light. It's lead, definitely. It's got to be a 72. I'm not sure, though. It's definitely lead. Here, let me see if you can see it. Oh, it's on deer slug. <laughs>